Have you seen The Last Dance? I lived it. But yes, I've seen it. I know you've <laughs> lived it, but did you see it? Okay. Oh, I saw it. First thing first, first thing off top. What do you think about former Chicago resident? I thought it was funny. And I, I, it's, it and popped I think, me. Uh, it's great. Slightly disrespectful, but it popped me. I saw your tweet, and, and I was like, I was going to comment, but I was like, you know what? That's fine. You can think that, but I don't think it is. I mean, it's, I it's, 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 it is, but it isn't, right? Because they, they did the same thing, almost the same thing for Bill Clinton, former governor. So Arkansas at first governor. I thought, yo, I see what they're doing. They're, they're saying whatever at the time they were during this run, that's what they're mm-hmm. saying. But Bill Clinton was definitely president in the late 90s. <laughs> so Yes, he was. <laughs> in like all <laughs> yeah. the 90s, essentially, except for you know the first uh, Bush years. So I don't, I don't get it. I don't get it. It's funny, but I don't get it. I'm, it's fine. Okay. But what what was your favorite part of the first two episodes so far? Because we got parts two and three, or three and four, when three people four. are watching this on YouTube or listening to it, we got it tomorrow. So what what were your favorite for, for um, parts of, of um, one and two? My favorite parts? I it's I think it's it's really the the Jerry Krause stuff. Because growing up, I I I know I didn't like Jerry Krause. Like I knew, kind of like, this team could and stay. He together, was the guy to hate, but he was, but he was the guy, and you would hear it too, like at ring ceremonies. You know, you hear him boo, and it's like you hear him booed. So, um, even I was actually at the last Bulls rally for the championship when we won the last, the sixth one, and even Jerry Krause came out there. It was just raining boos, and it's just, <laughs> you know, sucks. and we were in Grant Park, and that was great. Um. <laughs> There's a story I'll tell you off air about that. It's, it's oh. I won't say it on the air. That's yeah. It's pretty. I'll tell you. But I'll uh, tell you my favorite. My favorite part though. Yeah. My yeah, two yeah. favorite parts. So part two and spoilers. I'm sorry if anybody didn't watch it. You're a real loser. Uh, make like a tree and get out of here. But my favorite line from it, I'll say, is when Michael broke his foot and they were at, and then the owner, what's the owner's name again? Uh, Jerry Reinsdorf. Yeah, Reinsdorf. I'm getting the Jerry's mixed up. Um, when he asked him, hey, well, I know there's a 10%, you're saying there's a 10% chance I could be re-injured and my career's over, but there's 90% chance I'll be fine. And then Jerry goes, well, if I if you had a, a headache and I had a bottle of pills and nine of them will cure it, but one of them will kill you, would you still take the pills? And Michael Jordan says, depends on how bad the effing headache is, <laughs> which I thought was just a, <laughs> it's a great line. It's a great line. Right, it's but great. My, my favorite moment is they're overseas – they kicked the crap out of some J Brown team in the McDonald's championship so bad that one of the other players from the team asked Michael for his armband and he just takes yeah. it off his arm. Michael yeah. didn't even say anything. He's just like, take it. Just take it. Yeah. I just wax that ass. So go ahead and take it. And, and to speak to that point, actually, my other favorite part of that was they won like this McDonald's championship thing and Michael's like, this doesn't mean anything. This, this means nothing. What does- this is nothing. It's like congratulations, rookies. Rookies, you know, have that. And that's when he asked. You know. That's when he asked Jerry Krause if those are diet pills or do they make you taller. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, so sad. So, oh my Savage. goodness. And it's like, and the other part, I did feel, I did feel bad for Scotty. I know some people oh. don't have any sympathy well, for a millionaire or whatever, but like, they did him dirty, man. They, they did, did him dirty. dirty. But I also get where he was. Why I get why he signed. Oh, 100 percent. I get. I get why. why. Yeah. So I don't. Yeah. I don't fault him for signing it. But they should. They should have crumbled up that contract, threw it in yeah. the trash, and said, "Hey, let's do you right, my brother." Dude. And he's like making like two point eight mil, and Jordan's making like twenty something. Tony Ku coach should not be making more money than Scottie Pippen. My lord, it's it just Harper should not be making more money than Scottie Pippen. And you know, and I've thought for years, it's like there's no reason this team had to break up because Jerry Reinsdorf could have put the whole kibosh on it if he wanted to but he didn't so as much and so i thought that for years i mean as many people did in chicago have in chicago so it's like he told yeah we all hated jerry krause you could go 82 and 0 and you're still not going to coach the bulls it's crazy the dumbest thing i've ever heard we had to we had to talk about it here at the end of the schmodown we had to because frank's a former (laughs) chicago resident now uh so i had to ask (laughs) the former chicago resident what what he thought